Hey everybody, what's going on? Nathan343 here, and guess what? I DJ now at Pro X. Let's cut her open. guys appreciate it we've got pro X adapters for trussing that go up on the trussing so you can mount a light to it you know, you, it, it's sometimes hard to mount lighting up there, so this is pretty cool. These set on your truss, and they bolt in like your regular top plate would. It gives you a mounting point to mount moving heads. Other pictures, you could hang a light from the top and from the bottom if you have a small enough light that would fit in there. You can have it to where it's sitting like this, or you can have it where it's sitting like this. You could probably mount two lights on here on top if you have it over far enough. So. We're gonna go ahead, and get one of the uh, deals here. I'll put a bottom plate on it, uh, just so it's safe. I haven't got the bigger plates yet. Um, still debating on what size to get. But I probably won't even open those up because I have tons of pins, but it's always good to have extra pins. All right, so here we have our truss. We have it sitting on just a base plate. Uh, that came with this truss, the 13 by 39. Here we go. We're just going to take this, we can go like this. Slide it down on top, take a pin, slide it through. I think I'm just going to mount this stinger up here like so. This we're using a kind of cheap metal bracket oak white oak clamp here this is a two inch just go back up real quick i'll grab a uh, power cable just so you can see look at it just sitting up there how cool is that <clears throat> very cool now you could use two clamps if you want one seems to be holding it. I have actually this set up for my other truss, which runs two clamps. But sitting up like that, she looks to be holding. Of course, you can run your cable right up the truss, right up to it. And you can run your DMX cable down if you're doing wired, and then over to your next one. It's a very clean setup. <clears throat> I think it looks very cool. So, I like it. Something cool that you can do with when you're using this so you don't just have that single light up there as you get these flat side deals and you can put a moving head on the side so you're not losing that moving head effect on your totems now say this one was on the left side of your setup put one on the left you know but hey maybe i wanted a light on the right you can put a, a table thing over here and mount one right there so <clears throat> Yeah, of course, if you wanted to, you could drill up through the bottom and you could uh, mount that. You know, you've got the deal here where you can run your safety cable to the truss, uh, even though I don't think this will fall. And then you could put your, which I'm going to show you here in a few, uh, your truss warming. You could put it right there with a no clamp. And then you could mount the rest of your lighting however you want. You know, a disco ball, um, whatever you wanted to mount. So see, you still got your truss warming. It still looks good. Uh, this is not exactly centered right uh, where I would want it to, but it works just for uh, demonstration purposes. I would probably move that light over to this side and put that one a little differently. But yeah, I think it looks really good. Good way to mount lighting. Good way to show 
uh, different you know setups. It would be cool if they would make these in black and in like aluminum color so that they blend in. Um, I'm sure you could probably take it somewhere and have it dipped in aluminum to make it match if you wanted to. But uh, again, very cool setup. I mean, you could turn these you know, whichever way you wanted to point them in whichever direction. And then if you wanted to, you could even turn this sideways and have it to where like this would be the front part of your truss and that's all that people would see is that. But I think I would use it like this. I think it's very cool and I like it. I think they're very, very, very nice little adapters. So Pro X, I know several people have these. Cedars Link has them, uh, Global Trust has them. I think Pro X, you can get a set of these for, I wanna say. You can get a set of these, two of these shipped for 60 bucks a piece, 120 bucks. You can get two of these shipped to your house for two pieces of truss. So, very cool little setup. I do have a uh, gig I will be using this setup on uh, in September, so stay tuned to my. Well guys, here is both of the adapters on two pieces of trussing. This is two meter trussing with two stingers on top and we have two of the Intimidator Spot 260s on the side shelf. Makes for a really awesome little setup. Uh, you could do other setups with this. You could do other lighting. Again, uh, you would still be able to mount truss warming inside it. Looks really good in there. I think it looks very good. Definitely check these out in the description. pretty good I really really think that is really cool so anyway again link in the description uh, if you're looking for a set of these Elsa likes them don't you Elsa or said they're, they're pretty crazy anyway guys thanks for watching hope you enjoy go check these out links in the description thank you Pro X uh, for the cool book and all that stuff you sent with the uh, good package I will definitely be checking it out and probably ordering some more stuff so thanks guys check these out check out the the ADJ stingers the go check out sheds as uh, page uh, I will more than likely probably be running my uh, Intimidator 260s up there I think they look pretty cool go check them out link in the description like comment subscribe peace All right.